There needs to be a second round to this investigation that truly gets to the heart of the matter, which is the original data and original information that is still being withheld by China. We are going to continue to press in coordination with the international community, China to be transparent, to be forthcoming with data and information. We're not going to just stand by and accept that they've said they're not going to participate. We believe the WHO does need to be reformed. Some of those reforms are more programmatic and bureaucratic. They relate to ensuring greater efficiency and effectiveness in responding to things like the outbreak of COVID-19. Some of them are about making sure that there is not undue influence or interference by any single member state or country in the WHO. And then some of them relate to very targeted issues like the COVID-19 origins investigation, where I have personally and we collectively have been quite vocal about our view that there needs to be a second round to this investigation that truly gets to the heart of the matter, which is the original data and original information that is still being withheld by China. And our hope is that in the coming months, we will see a credible international investigation progress uh, including in respect to those items. We are going to continue to press in coordination with the international community, China to be transparent, to be forthcoming with data and information. We're not going to just stand by and accept that they've said they're not going to participate. Now, at the same time, as you know, we're also launching our own review and our own process, and I'm certain this will be a topic of discussion as the president goes overseas this week. And when you say that the White House is going to continue to press, what is that? What, what is that? What is pressing? We are engaging certainly at the highest levels and we'll continue to do that, uh, whether it's the Secretary of State or other leaders who engage on, a, on uh, through national security diplomatic conversations. Uh, and we will continue to work through the WHO and also with our international partners uh, to uh, exert that pressure and ensure that uh, we're all going to keep pressing for them to release date underlying data and participate in the second stage of this investigation.